Joe, don't you know how bad for the environment that is? What is? Driving that SUV! Don't you know that? What? How could it be that bad? It's just, like, 10 miles a gallon! That's bad, Joe. Really, really bad. Mistakes with our dealings with Mother Nature can have much larger, unintended consequences. Consequences? What consequences? When oil is burned, for example in an automobile, carbon dioxide is released into the atmosphere. Therefore, heat from the sunlight is being trapped under it. As a result, the temperature of the Earth's atmosphere and oceans is getting dangerously warmer. Well, how does that affect me? I actually like hot weather. Not only does it increase the Earth's temperature, but it has the potential to melt whole icebergs, therefore flooding cities such as New Orleans, Calcutta, London, and Shanghai. I'm warming you. Global warming is a big problem. Uh, it's so cold here. I bet a few years ago it was even colder. Because temperatures have started rising, icebergs have become melting. The whole world could be ice-free by 2030. We must take action now. Surely we have time to correct our mistakes. No, Joe. Imagine a pond in which the number of lily pads doubles each day. On the 30th day, the pond is full. On which day is the pond half full? Uh, the 15th day, right? No, Joe. The 29th day. We thought we were living in a stable linear world, but we are not. We are living in an accelerating exponential world. Until now, the changes have been so small that we did not notice them. Now, in the 20th century, things seem to be spiraling out of control. We must act now, Joe. <coughs> How on earth did this happen? <coughs> wow, you're obtuse. Weren't you paying attention in the last few scenes? Um, me and billions of other people drove SUVs and therefore released dangerous amounts of CO2 into the atmosphere. Yes. And then the heat from the sun was trapped under the thickened atmosphere because of the carbon dioxide. Yes. And now global temperatures have shot up. The North Pole has melted and flooded half the world. <coughs> the atmosphere has become unbreathable. The climate shot up and everyone either died of asthma or from the heat all because of me. <coughs> yes, this is what will happen to our environment if we do not take care of it. But there are things we can do to prevent this. By driving energy efficient cars and walking whenever possible, you can make a difference. By using energy from renewable resources, you can make a difference. By using less paper so trees aren't cut down, you can make a difference. You can make a difference if you are aware of the potential effects that we as a species have on the environment. You can make a difference!